This is KEZI 9 News at 6. Now, police right now are searching for a man accused of kidnapping a teenage girl in Springfield before she escaped by jumping into the river. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. Renee McCullough has the evening off. KEZI 9 reporter Daniel Arman is live on the banks of the Willamette River near the 600 block of D Street to show us what happened and how police say the girl got away. Danielle? Matt, Springfield police say a 16-year-old girl was reading in one of these benches along the bike path, and she said that's when a man attempted to kidnap her. And then she ran down this bank and jumped into the river below. Police say the victim's mom looked for her in the area at about 8 last night. Police found the victim's phone and backpack, but the girl was still missing. Two hours later, she returned home wet, dirty, and suffering from onset hypothermia. The victim told police she was the man was staring at her and blocked her when she tried to leave. Then he tackled her to the ground. She fought him off, jumped into the water and swam downstream where she hid in the bushes until dark. Neighbors say they are worried about safety in the area. A little bit scary because we live with some children and we've been bringing them down here and this is the first day we haven't come down here with them. So, you know, it's like now I'm going to be watching them even closer. I know for the most part that's, that type of stuff isn't really going on around here. So I was really shocked at that at first and I was worried about because my girl comes down here a lot. So I want her to be protected, you know. Between 40 and 50 years old, around 5 foot 9, 200 pounds, with straight disheveled hair and a short scruffy full beard. He was last seen wearing an olive green baseball cap, gray long sleeve flannel pants, over a white t-shirt, gray sweats and brown boots and moments ago we saw police in back out here investigating this crime and they are currently working with a sketch artist to get a better description of that suspect if you have any information on this crime or on the suspect you're asked to call springfield police live in springfield danielle arman kezi 9 news